Hello everybody! Back again! <laughs> now, in this video, we will work again in our red level Nelson spelling on unit 18. And we're going to work on the spelling rule called Magic E. Actually, unit 18, 19, and 20 all work on the Magic E rule. This rule is very important to master. Okay? The Magic E is sometimes called the Silent E. And what it does is it gives its energy or love or help, whatever way you want to understand it, to the first vowel. And that first vowel takes strength and she says her name, not her short sound. Okay, so with that you have the vowels A, that's its name, or we call that the long sound, A, ah, A, ah, as A, ah, right? And then you have E, E is its name, it's also called long sound. E is its original sound, you remember? E. Eh, eh, eggs that are going in the frying pan was bacon. <coughs> yummy, yummy. I, I is its long sound and its name. The long sound is equal to the name of the vowel. I, but its real, real original sound or short sound is I. Watch, whatever <laughs> you can say, eh, like an itch, or eh, when Inky the mouse spills all the ink everywhere. <laughs> to help you remember that this letter is called I, think of the I. Okay, then you have the long sound O, or its original short sound O, odd. Off, on, off, mm -hmm. and you, and its original sound or short sound, ah, uh, up, like umbrella, up, like the movie, up, ah, uh, ah, uh, okay, a, e, i, o, u, both the name of the letter and it's long sound. So magic E is important because the magic E, again sometimes called the silent E, creates the long vowel rule. So the vowel just before the silent E becomes its same sound as its name. In this unit 18 we'll work on the long vowel sound A, magic E. Okay. A magic E. So when you have the A magic E team, then the sound is A. Okay? So let's take a look at the keywords. Okay? I will read them twice. The first time, just listen. Ah, listen. Oh, I gotta need, need a haircut. <laughs> I keep saying that, but I don't do it. And I want you to listen the second time and repeat. Okay? This time, listen. Listen. Okay? Came, game, same, a, bake, cake, take, cave, gave, save, wave, shave. Okay, so you hear the sound A and you don't hear the E. The E is magic and silent and its magic goes to the vowel before and makes it the long sound. Okay, and in this part, unit 18, it's the sound A. A. Okay. 
Here we go again. This time, please repeat. Okay, okay. Uh. Came. Game. Same. Bake. Cake. Take Cave Gave Save Wave Shave A Okay, so up at the top this little picture, cute little picture with the little person and the big person making a cake. Making a cake. Okay, so it says, bake me a cake as fast as you can. So the a, a sound, fast, can, is its a sound. When you add the magic E or silent E, it becomes a. Bake me a cake as fast as you can okay mm, that would be fun <laughs> next you go to page 39 and you have extra and it wants you to do the same as we did in unit 17 you have rhyming families the ae rhyming words as in a Ave, aim. So all you need to do is copy these rhyming families, look very well at the picture, and then tick the words in the rhyming families that you see in the picture. Okay, for example, those are waves wave so you have the verb to wave and you have the ocean movement of water which is a wave okay very good then in your extension you've done this kind of exercise before it's called the what am i what am i you have your words in the box from these words you can also use the picture as a help a hint you read and you write it down I am a tiny bit of snow what am I a flake snowflake okay so look at the picture use the words from the box to answer the little hints of the question what am I okay now, I want you to take a look here for a little bit of help to understand how the magic E or silent E helps. In this rule, the A slash E, it's always a situation where you have the vowel plus a consonant and the silent E. Silent. And that gives you the long sound. In this case, the A plus a consonant plus the silent E or magic E. The magic gives to the A and makes her sound A, like its name. The easiest example is in Bake Me a Cake. Cake. So you have your A, you have your consonant. In this case, it's the K. And you have your magic E, which is silent. And we also call this the eyeglass rule. For all of the magic E, it's an eyeglass rule. You have your vowel, the consonant, and the silent E. So you have your eyeglasses. The consonant is like the nose in this concept. The first vowel, the consonant, and the silent E. That's the eyeglass rule. Okay, so magic E. And in our next units, it's continuing new sounds with the magic E. Okay, okay, bye-bye.